that a mass? Only shooting stars break the everybody and welcome to Brawl Stars. I'm Amy the Anazonian and today I'm playing Sauron, the Dark Lord, but specifically as a flavorful Nazgul. The ring tempts you deck, not just as Grixis control, though I do have a couple Grixis good stuff cards. Sauron, the Dark Lord is a brand new commander that's part of the Lord of the Rings expansion, which means it's legal in historic brawl and commander as well. Sauron, the Dark Lord has a really good ward cost and is pretty well statted on his own, a six mana seven six that makes your opponent sacrifice an artifact or legendary creature, it has to be a legendary artifact, if you want to target this. If you have an uncounterable kill spell, well, it gets through that and that's fine. But otherwise, you have to make sacrifices to get rid of Sauron. Whenever you cast a spell, including that kind of removal, you also get to amass, so you end up building up an army that grows and grows and grows. And if that army deals combat damage to an opponent, the ring tempts you. And the ring tempts you is its whole thing. And when the ring tempts you, you can discard your hand. And if you do, draw four. Awesome. So what do we care about? Amass. Ring tempts you. Clearing the way for our Sauron to go in and swing. So we have a bit of ramp because we want to be able to play Sauron a little early. We have some ways to protect Sauron, some things to give Hexproof, a couple counter spells, and most importantly, we have every single different art of Nazgul that's available in the game. Also, I guess technically this one. There's more than nine Nazgul actually in Arena, it turns out, because it gets some extra legends off to the side. That's great for us. It also is great because it is a card which you can play nine of in the deck and we fit all nine of them in here. If you're feeling like a lot of these cards look unfamiliar, it's either because they're new or they're from War of the Spark. We have a lot of things that amass zombies, because if you have an army, an army's an army, and it works great with Sauron. We also have some things that work specifically with our orc army, like Assault on Osgiliath. I totally said that one right. We have a little bit of removal. I tried to make this a fairly fair deck because this is not a deck that I'm playing in the queue. No, this is a deck that in this video, you're only going to see me play against one other person. And that person is Justin Parnell. Thank you so much, Justin, for playing with me. Uh, Justin will be playing three different decks in the video. Tom Bombadil, Gandalf the White, and Sauron. So if you're looking for any of those games, you'll find them in this video. What this deck is doing is making big armies, hitting face with them, and then getting the value off of Sauron. It's really cool. It's really fun. And feeling powerful when your opponent has to cast spells with your commander out, it's a good feeling. I gotta say, Zaron is a really strong card, and I'm sure you can build around it as purely a control deck. That's probably the strongest way to build it, but who can resist all these beautiful Nazgul, these strange counter spells that amass, these other interesting spells that tempt you with the ring? I certainly can't, and I certainly didn't. So, without further ado, let's check out some battles with me and Dustin Purnell. This is a direct challenge, and uh, my deck, as you can see, sure does have Nazgul's in it. We have so many new cards, actually. It's great. And he's playing Tom Bombadil. Oh, wow, we both have the ring. That's, uh, that's not how it's supposed to go. Temple of Bad Ice. A little bit more removal on top's never bad. Boithamolitis, yeah. So the Tom Bombadil's all about sagas. When your sagas die, you essentially get the next saga in your deck and it starts. It just goes right onto the battlefield. Let's get down Malher, or a Kai Captain. Makes that a mass a little bit bigger. Hmm. Army of Transients. How about we get tempted by the ring? Um, if I attack in here, they can block, so I won't. So here's this Jacuzzi tubs, thank you for the raid. We can go for Orcish Bowmasters. Swinging with the Nazgul. Happy Lord of the Rings Day, thank you. 
down Keely Archive so we can hopefully play Sauron next turn. Uh, I don't really care for any of these, but I think Prost and Grip will be a very helpful card to have against, you know, Sagas. Alright, so we've got Enter the God Eternals. We're just gonna go for Sauron here. We care about an army we control, which we don't currently have. Hidden. But every time they cast a spell, we get to amass. And now we'll kick off our army. Elvis Reborn. All right, we can sacrifice um, probably the Nazgul. Or the Orc army, because we can make a new Orc army. I'll drop the Nazgul. We can cross and grip that. destroy that even though it will come back we're going to change our orc army to be our ring bearer would i like to discard my hand no nah, i like the cards i have right now i'm an orcs orkin well they're smorkin How many transients returns? They have cast a spell, which means that our orc army grows. Uh, Elspeth's nightmare can kill Marhor. Oh my god, this orc army is disgusting. So big! Target opponent. So, in response to them targeting, we could use Lazita Plating. Do you, you block this? No? All right, well, then I'm actually going to Orcish Bowmasters. Ring tempts us. You remain my army. Would I like to discard my hand? No. Aha! Tom Pompadil did not get to do the saga thing yet. Oh, also, yes, this is an orc army zombie because we have now amassed with both zombies and orcs. Metamize prophecy. More, more! Yes! Only three mana left. Can the sagas destroy Sauron? I'll kill Kami of Transients. Enter the God Eternals. Oh, I guess I'll mill you. Say good game. Swinging with a very, very large orc army. Zombie. Nice! I feel like we did the thing. That's great. Got a Prismari command, commence the endgame, a Nazgul, widespread brutality. This looks like a keep to me. Oh, hey, Gothmog. Hey, I'm just Gothmog. I have mass. You do, Data Mass. Oh, the Wanderer! That's great for, um, getting yourself some lands whenever you have those sagas enter the battlefield. Cloud Key, I assume naming enchantment. I like getting down at that school. The ring will tempt me, and the Nazgul will be my ring bearer. Nazgul 
not shocking that in Commuve Transients, this can come back from the graveyard. I feel like they wouldn't double block. Two damage. Draw and discard. I really want land. There's a land. Uh, I'm going to draw Bilbo and I want to hit Brides for Brutality. Yeah. Yes, it makes an army, but no, it's not that good. There we go. Mountain. History of Benalia. Gonna make a knight, then another knight, and then make those knights extra big. No, oh my god, the deck does not need Grand. Chat has an obsession with Grand. Grand lovers in the chat. I'm being told everything needs Grand. Everybody wants to be a Grand. And now they're all typing Grand. Thank you. Uh, everybody in the chat really wants Grand. Healthy appreciation of Grand. Deep lust for Grand. Almanachi cheered. X420. Grandor calls for aid. Thank you, Almanachi, for the 420 bits. That hurt me emotionally. Uh, do I want the mystery cards or these two? I want these two cards. Those look good. There's two lands. Uh, who wants to be my ring bearer? Right now, my Nazgul is a ring bearer. Just keep the Nazgul as a ring bearer. Gets me a draw and discard. Oh, Workish Bowmasters. Yes, get that in hand. I'm going to drop all of the invasion. Tom Bombadil turns their history of Benalia into Binding of the Titans. Socratic underscore Phoenix cheered. X420. Grand, 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 grand. G N O R N D G R O R N R N D G R O N R N R D D G R R N N F N D N D. Thank you, Socratic Phoenix, for the 420. Blaze it. Um. Rip to my army. <gasps> I want to get off of Gron's wild ride. Gothmog, do a trade, please. Thank you. Come of transients comes back into hand. Almanati cheered. X100. Here today. Grand tomorrow. <laughs> Here's Sauron. Yeah, I'm 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 just just dealing with a lot of grandification here. Land's actually just fine here, but I'd rather have black mana, so I'm gonna throw that to the bottom. So now, if they cast a spell, I get army. Army good. I can exile two cards from graveyards, but ideally not one that they want to reanimate. We have to discard. Uh, I will discard... I'm trying to decide if I want to keep this board wipe here. I need no removal. Removal, silly. Burn rejuvenation. Uh, for five, five permanents come into play. They got Alayla, Melomized Prophecy. Oh my God, Mending of Dominaria, 
bath song. Great. Um, and Waking the Trolls. They destroy one of my lands. Burning Rejuvenation. Not a card that should exist. Are they fond of the Grand? They're very fond of the Grand. Nessian Wanderer, by the way, Constellation is triggering for each of those. Alayla only triggers on cast, but she's still good. I'm probably going to want to wait until Waking the Trolls fires at Chapter 3 to use Meat Hook Massacre. Indestructible. Ah. Socratic underscore Phoenix cheered. X100. The Grands start coming and they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. I can't with you. <laughs> Chat with the Grand attack. You're all grounded. They get the next saga in their deck, which is Fable of the Mirror Breaker. It's gonna make some goblini. What are you going to name? Unminimized Prophecy. There's so many freaking sagas! They're still taking my Nicol Bolas, which... I can only hope that they plus two and steal from me. Naming Kami of Transients. That's a fair card to play next turn. I did consider Orcish Bow Mastering there to be like, oh, but no, I want to save this until after I board wipe. There's familiar comes out. It only seems like it's insane because everything happened at the exact same time. I'd love to wait for this, but we might have to board wipe this next turn. Ooh, wait a minute. One ring to rule them all. They're going to wipe the board. Uh, this Nazgul, by the way, is currently a legend because the ring has tempted it. Is Tom Bombadil the ring bearer? Yes. Elspeth conquers death. Exiling... Sacrifice a legendary creature. Or artifact. Return to me. Aww. Bye, Nazgul. Show respect for your god, Barrow. Can't block it. I might just want the card draw, but that board wipe is incoming. We don't take it. X equals four. Thanks. Oh, that's not the nerfed Meat Hook Massacre. That's regular Meat Hook Massacre. Oh, 
it's because we're direct challenging. I forgot. Is Nikki B still on the field? Yeah, and hitting him won't do anything. I also can't see him. There he is. It's, it's probably not friendly brawl. It's probably historic brawl that's just not working correctly for direct challenges. My creature is dead. Couple trolls. Gotta get that Thomas Bombus out. Hi, Tom. There's a lot of things that are about to happen. Oh, you're gonna plus? One moment. I'm gonna drop Cruelty of Gix. Heal the Archive. Oh, that's not... You can't use that one. We don't use that button here. Tom po yes, Tom has Hexproof and Indestructible. Legendary. Put it in your hand. Oh, Tom's going off. Alright, so we can do some of this. Another board wipe. Uh, well, certainly. I, I think they might be out of sagas. Because they didn't get any more? Keep amassing. More! More! There's another one in hand, Restoration of Iganjo. They get a planes. A basic planes, but only if there isn't... There has to be one in the deck. Like, I already see a basic planes out here. There might only be one, because it's a five-color deck. Yep, it, it whiffed. I am going to block the Troll Warrior. And I'm not dead. But I am also- I am almost dead. Yay, I gained one life. I did it. Okay, that's a Nazgul and this is Sauron. Um. Make my zombie army. Hello! Oh! Rock Snubs! I actually made a, uh, a video about this. Cards from set. Boots! I made a video about my favorite, my favorite five cards that are just, like, to have as good stuff. Um... Raph Capuchin. I mean, I guess he cares about... Historic cards. Thank you, unnerfed Meat Hook Massacre. 
trying to think, who am I top two? Delighted Halfling, I think might be my number one. Who I think is my, my number two favorite card. I have a folder on my computer that's called Cards I Like from Lord of the Rings. That's what I made my video out of. Hmm. I think Delighted Halfling's my number one. And Orcish Bowmasters, which you just saw, is probably my number two. I'm still alive because we gained so much life. And also because they wiped their own board. Call of the Ring. Hey, I need that so I can get tempted by, like, the ring or whatever. Here's the Dark Lord Sauron! Back again on the battlefield. Tom Pompadour currently unblockable because it is their ring bearer. Don't target it. Oh no. Meshi's about to die. <laughs> Yay, I get to gain a life! The double strike happens from the war. Tom Bombadil is fresh out of sagas. <laughs> and we die! Yeah! First strike. This hand has ramp. I have a six mana commander, so I want to get it out quickly. Oh, I'm being asked for a vocabulary word. RMRT cheered. X100. Happy birthday, dark side cookies. Nice. Your vocabulary word is prattle, P-R-A-T-T-L-E, meaning meaningless, foolish talk. Her husband's mindless prattle drove Heidi insane. Sometimes she wished she would just shut up. Synonyms include babble, blather, chatter, gibber, and gibberish. And Illuminati, thank you for gifting us up to Dark Side Cookies. They found their one planes. more black mana here. We can wash away their commander, but I don't think they'll be able to play their commander this turn. Ramp! Good ramp, good ramp. Throw down the Scalds, it's a good saga. Gets four cards in exile. Let's see, I see... Dawnheart, Geist, Elspeth's Nightmare, History of Benalia, and the Kami War. Kami War is really scary. Of those. I'm going to play Vizier of the Scorpion. And I will trust Auto Tapper and... Be a fool for doing so, because it did not hold open my Wash Away mana. It instead hold up, held open a uh, Murderous Rider. Which, that's fine. We can kill a thing. I was more afraid of Kami War, though. And there it is. Goodbye, my delectable permanents. Oh, I could have still countered it because it's not from hand. That's fine. We've got Gorbag and Burad Dur. I'll choose pile number two, which is Ragavan and Blood Crypt. Who wants to be my ring bearer? Uh, this one. The, the Death Touch Amass. He's sitting in. Can't be blocked. Uh, you are my ring bearer still. Would I like to discard my hand? No. Hit my army. No, my really cool army! 
I'll discard... Ooh, Murderous Rider. I know what I want to do. It might involve monkeys. I mean, what what in my life doesn't involve monkeys? Oh, Mending of Dominaria. It'll mill. I am currently untempted by the ring. This is not a zombie. Yet. We're going to attack in with these two. It's not a zombie. Okay. Not entirely true. It wasn't a zombie. Now it's a zombie. Nice. Thanks. Hold up in the wash away for our good friend Tomble Bomble. Oh, Kagachi made manifest. I like how you can tell that uh, Justin pressed the swag button. Everything that has an alt art has an alt art. Oh my god, that is an eerie ultimatum. These are all coming back. Welcome home. They don't have any legendary artifacts or creatures, so they can't kill this off um, finding the old gods. Nice triumphant reckoning. Can bring all those back again. They're back again is cool. Roll of Isildur. Don't steal things. I considered putting that in this deck. Yay! A mass! Um... I... I don't want my Mind Stone stolen, but I think it's fine. And then we'll get tapped. That is your Ring Bearer. It's a spirit. get tempted by the ring make my orc army my ring bear it can only be blocked by this spirit token would i like to discard my hand no really like the cards i have they're good cards What if Ragavan was my, my ring bearer? Oh, so difficult to block. Treasure. Treasure token. Tapped and stunned. They can discard. Bring back. Blood Crypt. Oh, hey, Baron. I think I follow you on Twitter. One monkey to rule them all. <laughs> A lot of card draws happening here. Lands in play. That's going to be exiled. There, there really isn't any purpose to casting it. Since there's no graveyard, Okagachi won't get anything. You can definitely play there and back again, though. Oh, wait, there was one thing. Right, the Mending of Dominaria sacrificed this turn. So I take 11 damage. No Tom Bombadils. I think, I think that he might have enough mana to cast it again. Perfect for extra Tom and extra Bomb. It's a board wipe.
bring back a creature. Oh, I was going to Cruelty of Gex. What chapter do you go to? Chapter one, I ain't got nothing. I know, I'm disappointed too. Oh, cool. Do you have any creatures? I like imagine there's no creatures in hand. I'm going straight for chapter two. Well, that would be the funniest one, wouldn't it? Go for Tails End or Lazatip Plating as well. <gasps> what if I go for my tiny orc? All right, which, which chapters are about to fire? Drawing cards. Tutoring. Flipping, nothing. Oh no, gets a, a battle? No, it gets a, gets Halvar and equipment. Huh, nothing, nothing, okay. I want something that makes an amass at instant speed. I am sorry that this is taking so long. It's so hard to search. I wish I could just Type it in. We're going for the Bowmasters. I need a red source for assault on Osgiliath. I'm so good at saying that. Yes, draw a card. I'm sorry, I just hit my microphone. I put nine different Nazguls into my deck. Each one has a unique art. Also, hi, Jorbs. What would they tooted for? I feel like there's not that many equipments. Unusual saga to put into the deck. Treasure ain't bad, though. I got my Mind Stone back! I haven't lost my mind. Tiki Tiki, Artifact of Restoration. This gives me a Mass Orcs X. Give these Double Strike, but I need Triple Red to play it. Thinking. Uh, hello? I've got garbage. I mean, gore bag. Is your the scorpion Nazgul? I think I technically actually have 10 Nazgul in the deck because I put in the Witch King of Angmar. There's careful tapping happening here. Very careful tapping. I could have had 11, yeah, but I don't like the reanimating one. Didn't feel as good with the rest of this. All right, who's getting a plus one, plus one counter? The architect is. Eerie ultimatum! I can't counter it. But I can wait until all these abilities go on the stack. And then find out what happens. Because there's going to be a lot of these. Okay. Uh, steal an artifact. Make a treasure. Uh, destroy a thing. Exile the top four. Exile a thing. That's rough, buddy. If only you were drawing cards. I do not get to reanimate. So that must have been shuffled back into the deck with the Mending of Dominaria. That's how they were able to get it again. My turn! Nobody smorks an orc. 
Um, not quite what I need. But like, can't block it. And you're gonna lose some life. Oh. Um, well, I don't have mana for that, but I do have mana for this. And that's cool. Or on the necromancer. Reanimates things. But they don't stick around unless Sauron is my ring bearer. Counter spells, schmounter spells. I have an unblockable ring bearer that drains for three because we're at the full the ring. Please please don't bounce my orc army. Uh oh, they're bouncing Sauron though. A murderous rider. I have to discard a card. Bye, Sauron. Yeah. Bill Bowman and his buddy Sauron. It's fine. Okay, so dance and amance. Soul transfer. Stomping ground. Doesn't matter. I'm dead. I have no blockers. They're all tapped. Wait. <laughs> yeah! Just like a little petty vengeance right at the end. GG, Tommy! Gandalf the White! This is a panharmonicon effect for legendary permanents and artifacts. Also, um, has flash and gives those spells flash, so things are gonna be happening fast and dirty. Here's Dreadhorn Invasion. What does it do? It amasses. It also hurts me, but if my amass token gets big enough, it will gain me life back. Hmm, yes. I don't have that many cards in here that are just the good stuff and not part of the theme, but I couldn't resist a Crucius. Uh, what do I want to discard? I'm going to discard Gleaming Overseer, Commence the Endgame, Saruman's Trickery, the land. I'm going to discard the land. Ooh, File of Galadriel. Perfect for top decking. Ah, some sort of cool sword that makes spirits. I control legendary creature. Perfect. File of Galadriel. Swinging in with these. I'm going to discard Gleaming Overseer. Holding up my counter spell here. And we're going to choose something that costs more. White stone and weak stone. That would kill my Crucius. I don't want that. But now this is a zombie uh, orc army. It's the power of friendship. Let's get that ring in here. Get that ring, get that thing. Um, Let's make Sauron tempted by the ring. Would I like to discard my hand? Sure, I only want two cards. I want four cards. Discard a card. Yes, please. I'll discard a Nazgul to get something that costs more than a Nazgul. Combat Thresher enters the battlefield, draws two. No, draws one, because they don't have a Gandalf out. Grand Spider. Makes sense. It's uh, an artifact. Gets both of us a Power Stone. So cool. I think we got to end it. One, two, three, four. File. The file is why I drew five cards there. Which I thought was pretty neat. Toss down Bilbo. Get another chapter of ring bearing on. I'm going to discard my hand. And that's going to draw me five cards. Swing in. 
we draw, we discard. I'll drop Underground River. The ring tempts me. You are still my ring bearer, but I like to discard my hand. Yes. It's fun. I like discarding. It makes me feel like I'm I'm accomplishing something. Oh wow, a gore bag. I'm so glad that my name isn't gore bag. Becomes a mere convert, makes my army grow. One, two, three. Touch the spirit realm. This will be able to exile. Or back the Amazonian. Yay, I get a new army. This one's not as good. Um, do damage, destroy an artifact. I know this one can block. But this one is legendary. It's a 2-2. Two, two. We're gonna get tempted by the ring. Bilbo will become my ring bearer. Uh, sure. <laughs> ah, perfect. A foray of orcs. Oh, nice. That's two damage to the face. Ignore lethal. Make Bilbo hold ring. Oh, Bilbo's still the ring bearer. Thank you, Bilbo. Thank you, Bilbo. Things we have. All cost three. Part of the card. Meticulous excavation. Ah, oh, they can uh, put things back into their hand for extra enters the battlefields. Yes, I'm only playing against uh, Justin. This is a direct challenge because uh, there is no queue for Brawl in this event. So yeah, he prepped a bunch of decks. I only prepped one. I didn't realize he was going to go this ham on it, but like awesome. Hmm. I do want a Nazgul. Tempted by the ring. Isle of Galadriel. Swinging in for two. Um, excavation can put itself into your hand. There's Gandalf the White. Thought about countering, but like, I, I want to see Gandalf in action. Also, we have a River's Rebuke. Bit of both. Gandalf attacks! They can play things with Flash. Here comes Sauron! The Immortal Sun going to make their stuff bigger. Draw an extra card. And that was cast while Sauron was still on the stack, so I wouldn't get the Amass token. In the Archive. Ooh, that's going to get a double trigger. There's both a legendary artifact and a legendary creature that could be discarded or um, sacrificed for Gandalf. Ancestral Bleed. The graveyard. And on the second trigger. What busted broken spells you have. Gandalf the White.
Would you like to trade with my Nazgul? Just gonna pop everything back into hand. Swinging on in. Hello. Hello. I think the mana could have been floated to recast Gandalf there. Would I like to discard my hand? No. Am I stinky? You be stinky. Do be stinky. Approach! They gain life! That would kill my Nazgul. Probably not the best idea. How about a Gleaming Overseer? Orcish Bowmasters. Bing bong! Bit of a shock. We draw. We discard. Boom, boom, pow! Um, you're the new ring bearer. But more importantly, we're drawing five. Ah, the precious. We are almost done having the ring tempt us. One, two, three. Yeah, that's fair. GG Gandalf! This is just to show off that each Nazgul in my deck has different art, because I think it's really, really cool! I like ring wraiths. They have a really cool design. And oh, they also get better when you have more of them. Ooh, the Citizen's Crowbar. That can destroy some of my homeboys here. We're gonna go with this Nazgul first. Ring tempts us. It is my ring bearer. Dural Flame of the West. Makes those attacking spirits. Nazgul again. Nazgul 2. This equal to Nazgul. Um, you're still my ring bearer. That ability does stack. That's pretty sweet. I mean, you'll be able to reanimate that Nazgul. And when I reanimate the Nazgul, I can make you my ring bearer so it sticks around. Nice, it's a 5-3. Turbo schematic makes a little guy. Dang blockers. Oh look, another Nazgul. How neat. We draw, we discard, swarming of Moria. Yeah, I don't need swarming of Moria. Thanks though. Yeah, these spirits will be able to hold the uh, flame of the west. If you're wondering why the citizen token made a uh, made two spirits instead of one, it's because it was their ring bearer, I think. No. Why, why was it legendary? Why did it make two? As if it's... Wait. Ah! The tokens would be attacking. That's what the difference is. See, I gotta learn. More Nazgul's, please. Sauron, you're my ring bearer. Bringing back a Nazgul. Each of these Nazgul's gets its trigger stack. 
Oh my god. That was disgusting. Ah, I see what it is. It, um, it's just they come in tapped rather than tapped and attacking. It sticks around. Yeah! It's a card! Works very well with Nazgul, it turns out. Take it, Mender! It's gonna gain them some life! I wish this said goblins and orcs and ringwraiths. <laughs> More blockers. Oh, they come and tap, though. Take five. Didn't quite get to five mana for Gandalf. This is important to me. It's not about protecting. It's about, um... Widespread brutality. Because it's... What we do. We amass! And then we... We smash these things up. Circuit Mender is alive. Everybody's swinging in. We bring back the last Nazgul that we had. And the triggers happen again. Good game. Scanned off again. Okay, let's do this. I only have two colors, so I am actually going to mulligan here. Hello! I don't have monkey mana. No monkey. I'll play garbage. I'm sorry, gore bag. I can sacrifice that to make a treasure. But only if it hits them. Get the Nazgul out here. Hmm. I want a Nazgul. You can be my ring bearer, garbage. It turns out that if Gandalf tries to uh, get the ring himself, it doesn't go that well. So they do have five mana up for Gandalf to be flashed in. But we're ready. Both counter spells and murder. Mm, yeah, okay. I want a treasure. Or draw a card. Maybe it will be a land. That's not a land! It's a Lazatep Chancellor. Oh, I'm sorry, but, like, you were so glorious that the ring just tempted me. I'm sorry. It happens. Sorry, Justin. Eternal Wanderer. Can make me sacrifice one of my two creatures here. Or can just blink one, or can make a samurai. Oh. Didn't choose to blink. Only one creature at a time can attack the Eternal Wanderer. Whee! What are we discarding? Call of the Ring. It says, ring a ding ding. Check out this thing. Uh, Gwandor called for aid. And got exiled. Condor calls for aid. Nobody picked up. Gandalf! The no, Gandalf! No, not that one. I'm trying to target... Gandalf! Come yeah, yep. There we go. Now it's targeting the right one. Imagine if it didn't ask, are you sure there? It's like, no, I definitely clicked Gandalf, according to me. Hello? 
Uh, hello? Goodbye, monkey. It's not your time. I can't pay the one to amass. But every time we attack with our ring bearer, we will be drawing and discarding. Ow! We got some smorks. I'm sorry, some orcs. In we go. We'll discard. I'm not going to pay the one because I'm going to just commence the end game instead. Because that should be lethal. Good game. I just typed to Justin, poor Gandalf. Ah, it's a mirror match! Sauron versus Sauron! Perfect, excellent. See if there's anything interesting in their hand for me to turn into. Perhaps any orcs? Any smorks in the house? Oh, a Nazgul! I won't get the entry to battlefield for it, but being a Nazgul seems decent. Not gonna lie, I don't even remember seeing this card when I was searching through cards for this deck. Uh, I could undo that. Or I could ramp. Ramp good. It's not a Sauron, it's a Sauroff. It's a Sauroff. Here we go, well, Mass Works 1. Discard. I'm going to destroy Mind Stone or Heart. I'm going to destroy Mind Stone. On Sars, you're on. Can't believe you'd do that. Arch from the Black Gate seems fun, though. I have that in my deck, too. It means whenever this attacks, it will further amass. No amass. <gasps> I know fear. It's time for Sauron. Yes, it is. What can I do against Sauron? Very little, except for play my own Sauron. So I need the mana for that. I could also get a death toucher. Wouldn't be terrible. Enjoy your army. Doomblade, Demonic Tutor, and Regrowth. I'll take the toots, and I will drop Prismari Command. The amass grows. You block, Valky will come back. They get to play a Nazgul, though. The ring dims you. I get a plus one, plus one counter and stuff. It's sweet. I'll get to draw a full new hand. Nice. Oh, the Cletus! Hey, garbage. Unfortunately, I do not get to choose what side we get. We always get the front side. Ah, uh, commence the endgame, Sauron's Ransom, and Otawara. That's a bounce spell. I don't remember which board wipes I put in the deck. It's all, like, the damage-dealing ones. 
Mass the ox. Ooh, because this is legendary. They actually have enough mana for Ottawara here. We'll have to sacrifice a Nazgul, though, or the Celestus. Garn returns into hand. Valky is dead. Ripping peppies. Draw a little bit. Get a bigger army. This gets bigger. Nice. Oh, Liliana would also be good, but I need one more mana to make that work. That'll work. Demonic Tutor. Yes, you do amass. But I know what I crave. Lily would also bounce, or uh, River's Rebuke would also bounce everything into hand, but this feels like the way. Ooh. So some blinking. Like, bloop, bloop. Little purple lights there. Zarin returns to the battlefield. We will make a Zomboy. Here comes Sauron. They will get a, an army. But I'm going to get some armies too. And my armies will grow bigger because they're going to get extra tokens or counters. I know the names of things. Looking good. When there's attacks in, it'll grow bigger. Um, ours will just grow bigger when they cast a spell. We don't actually have one right now. Oh, now we will! Up to one creature, can't block for as long as I control. They're in back again. Okay. So this zombie is just gonna chill. This is their ring bearer. They discard and draw some more. Nice, nice. A Nazgul. Now 4-4. Four, four. Changing who the ring bearer is or keeping it as the orc army. That is still our, our ring bearer. Get the plus one, plus one counter. And discard and draw. The only thing I can block with is Maher. Maher? This guy. This only triggers on hitting face for getting tempted by the ring. I am willing to sacrifice this creature, though. I mean, it would be sacrificed anyway. Prevent six damage. Draw a card. Thank you, Lily. Oh, two Nazgul! Two Nazgul are better than one. And garbage is here, too. Infernal Grasp. Ooh! Sacrificing your orc army because it is legendary. I like it. How many Nazgul should I play? Every one of them, every day. Your army grows. Oh, get a mountain. It can be a non-basic mountain, which is nice. So much learning, so many cards. Mm. 
We right now do not have a ring bear. No rings are born. All impatient plotter. This, when the ring, when it leaves the battlefield, has a ring tempt you. Ah, or they could claim the precious. Nice. I'm gonna get that smog next turn, though. Ooh, that's gonna be fun. Discard and draw again. I can't block it. The ring's temptations will continue. <laughs> There's a fly attacking my face. This also, uh, I lose an extra three life. Block with this zomboy. Too many cards. Too little life. And a fine ring bearer this, <laughs> this orc army is. Nice, Lazage of Chancellor. Going to turn those discards into amasses. Further amass. Ooh, I can't block that because that has flying. Pretty sure we're just dead next turn. But, you know. Gotta have my Nazgul. That will be able to block. Discard it? Nope, not yet. I got more of these first. Do it. You draw five from file. More Nazgul! Attack with Sauron. It's fine. Fine. Not a problem at all. Except for the big old full lion guy. The ring tempts them again. We say... Gucci game! Because there's nothing I can do. But I did make some big Nazgul. Oh, I like how they... I love how all of them trigger. It's very satisfying. Here comes Smog. Smog is haste. Smog is haste. Ring things happen. Ooh, turn it into a zombie army too. Yeah! It's orc zombies! GG! Want three lands? Failed to get it? Got a counterspell. Got the call of the ring. There's a third land. Perfect. Old Steelheart. The romp! Of Epiphany. Get me more lands. I love that. The Celestis. And a land might be able to play Sauron next turn. I should probably appropriately hold up Glorious Gale. Which target, uh, counters target creature. Otherwise, Toll of Invasion would have been cool. Get myself an army. Air and back again. There's no creature. Call the ring. There's the 
There's that sixth mana source. Um, I'll let, I'll let that resolve. It is very strong with Sauron. Let that resolve, too. Daytime, nighttime, nighttime, daytime. Comes in tapped. She got in there. Now's cool. Go for the throat. Turn into a lot of treasures when it dies. Who's their current ring bearer? Nobody, I believe. Yes, nobody is their ring bearer. I take the big hit. Ring. Um. No. Too scary. Hmm. Comes in tapped. We're gonna dig for a little bit of counter spells. There we go. Say judgment. I'll take it. I'll drop a Nazgul. Um, I think I need you to block. Keely Archives. It's not an okay card. So right now, there's 9, 10, 11, 12 damage coming in. Ooh. Ring tempts them. This will actually make it lethal. Depending on um, if they use that. Go for the throat. Ah, Ring Wraith comes back. Nice. That's nah, game. Hey, the one on the Chancellor? Two mana. Not enough. Three mana. That seems better. The ring. The ring. I'm ready. Sauron the Dark Lord. You go first. Hmm, what if you didn't have an army, actually? And I had an army. I'm trading armies. Ah, oh, I see, I see. Of course, of course. This means war. Ah, Fall of Karandros. Excess damage turns into excess orcs. Can get rid of that if we need to. Land means time for Sauron. Need to have a legendary artifact or creature to get through that, unless you have an uncounterable kill spell. The ring is tempted, Bilbo. And Gollum's there too, which is kind of weird. Uh, thank you, um, Krishnak. 
Those are both legendary. That's why I couldn't take them. In we go. The ring tempts them again. They have no ring bearer. Because I moited him. It's gonna get them very deep into the ring, though. Ours grows their shrinks. And all's fair in orcish warfare. Hello! Um... Krishnak, you're a ring bearer, right? Sure. He always has been. Let me go over here. It's going to get them two creatures. Time for Gorbadge. Sorry, garbage. Nope. Gore bag. I want to empty up the hand a little bit. Swinging with everybody. This can only be blocked by the zombie army with the gleaming overseer. Getting blocks all around. The Nazgul. Nice. The Death Touch is very good at discouraging me from attacking. Cool Ring Bear. Mork! Mork is short for more orcs. Let's get ourselves nice and tempted by the ring or something like it. This card and draw. Oh, hell yeah. Orcish Bowmasters. Chill here. Wish some bow masters. This is my number one top card of this set. Put it in your decks because your opponents will probably draw cards. Before that comes down, get him! Now draw a card, I dare you! <laughs> I wish I could make my opponent draw a card. If only. Orcish Bowmasters murdered for spite. Okay, time for one more. So this is our last game. The last battle between Cordell and Zonian. Let's roll. I got a turn two march from the Black Gate. Try to get that tempo going. Got a damage-based board wipe, spiteful banditry, some Nazgul's Bilbo. The whole party's here. We march. Behold my army! A 1-1 one, one now, but soon to be a 2-2, two, two, a 3-3, three, three, a 4-4. Four, four. Let my monsters grow! Down Nazgul. Yeah, you can be my ring bearer. Bilbo's coming down. The ring is ever so tempting. 
our army will grow for the March to the Black Gate. Get to draw and discard. Since we're ahead, I think I'm going to drop Spiteful Banditry. Can we gen up? Ransom's card draw. Nickel Bolus is just Grixis and good. Nice. A Nazgul. He dead Nazgul. We draw, we discard. I'm going to drop Commence the Endgame because I want lands. Get ourselves a treasure. I can use that treasure for Sauron's Ransom. His handsome Ransom. An Orc! Time for a mini game. Please look at the top four cards in my deck and put them into two piles. Oh. I'll take these three instead of the mystery card. Bilbo's my new ring bearer. Or on the Dark Lord. Who's just like hanging with Bilbo, I guess. We get our treasure. Thank you, Bilbo. Very tempting you are. Another Nazgul. Two blockers. Guess we're just gonna swing in. And that is game. Boop. Stuck on three lands. That's too bad. Thank you so much for watching this unusual episode of Brawl Stars. This was filmed in the early access event, which I gotta say thank you to Wizards of the Coast for giving me access to it. Uh, I was able to play through a direct challenge only. There wasn't a queue, but thank you so much to Justin Parnell for gaming with me. Uh, it was actually his idea. He reached out and was like, hey, we're going to be able to do historic brawl, sort of. Do you want to do historic brawl? And I was like, sure, I'll brew up a quick deck. We'll have fun. I played as many of the new cards as I could. And I think that the games turned out really, really well. Um, if you'd like to see me record Brawl Stars and other videos live, you should come over to twitch.tv slash Amazonian. I do more than just record videos here. I also play tons and tons of drafts, which I don't usually put on YouTube because people don't watch them, which is a shame because I love drafting. Currently, I've been playing a ton of the cube draft and uh, five color good stuff is the name of the game. It's one of my favorites. Thank you so much for watching and have a brawlful day.